Here we go, we've got the tickets there you are, Get Roy, Connie, and I think that's me, brilliant. See you in a month. Hold See you in four weeks. Yeah, wicked. Let's Come go on, on then. Okay. See ya. Bye, have a good trip. Thanks a lot. We were on our way to Japan's capital, Tokyo, meaning Eastern City, and a mammoth 12-hour flight lay ahead of us. Japan is a chain of volcanic islands about twice the size of the UK, and it's home to a whopping 127 million people. For hundreds of years, Japan's rulers shut the country off from the rest of the world. Although many traditions still survive, today Japan is the most high-tech country on the planet. Oh, welcome to Tokyo, everyone. Yeah. Tired. What a flight. Brilliant. We set off at 1 o'clock yesterday, now it's 9 o'clock the following morning. Yeah, so it's 11 and a half hours, but it feels like 20. Uh, the only problem we've got now, guys, is we don't speak much Japanese, do we? Oh. No. Uh, but don't worry, we've got a handy little booklet here, and uh, page 23 is our hotel. Ah, but right. how do we get it? Well, if you look on page 17, you'll find a taxi. Come on. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's right as well. It's this way. We'd be staying in an area called Shibuya, known for its neon lights, busy streets and sky-rise hotels. Just had a, a quick wash and brush up, and I'm feeling a lot better. Now, I'd heard uh, that Japan was full of surprises, but I wasn't expecting one so soon. Uh, just feast your eyes, or maybe your bum, uh, on this, because this is the ultimate toilet. To start with, it's got a, it's got a heated seat. Uh, to keep your bum warm. And then I found these uh, buttons on the side. I wasn't sure what they did, so I pressed them. Look at it go, look at it go! <laughs> it's a beauty. <laughs> that is basically uh, a bum washer. <laughs> if you think that's impressive, have a look at the bath. <laughs> Now, that basically means I'm about to run your bath. Have you put the plug in? Well, I haven't, so thanks for reminding me. What about this, eh? I tell you what, if the toilet and the bath are this high tech, I can't wait to see what the rest of the city's like. Apparently, this is the way to travel. Is it? Can you sit here pretend to be the drivers? Yeah. This is one of Tokyo's three monorails, and because it's built above the ground, not only does it get you to your destination very quickly, but it also gets you there without any traffic jams at all. It also gives you a great view of the city. Now, you're probably wondering why we're wearing these. Well, it seems to be the norm around here. Everyone in Tokyo seems to be wearing a face mask. Yes, they do. It's basically because the people of Japan are very polite people. And if they've got a cough or a cold, instead of spreading it everywhere, they keep it to themselves with the aid of one of these. Ah, oh, how considerate. Plus, if there's lots of pollution or pollen in the air, then it stops you getting hay fever as well. Good, huh? It's right. Respect for others is a major part of Japanese society. And even though it's a huge city, Tokyo has one of the lowest crime rates in the world. And to put that to the test, I'm going to leave this set of very fancy chopsticks out in display for the entire day. And then when I come back later on, I'm going to check and see if they're still here. And that camera up there is going to record everything that happens. Taxi! Thank you very much. And to take good manners just one step further, have a look at this. Even the cars are polite. Whoa! <laughs> That's, That's great. great. Come on, come on, Zoe. In you come. Can you out? Everyone Enjoy. comfy? Yeah, yeah, yeah great. Yeah. And when you're in, the door even closes for you. No way, look at that. <laughs> it's a grass eye, it's a grass eye. We'd picked up a few words of Japanese, but wanted a crash course in Tokyo style. So we headed for the fashion district of Harajuku, where the city's trendsetters come to hang out. Arigato! Well, that was about 3,000 yen, which is the Japanese currency, which is roughly about 15 pounds. Now, that's the downside of Tokyo. It can be very, very expensive. Where are we going, guys? I like your ears. It's good. What, what's this for here, this back? Oh, what is going on? 
a lot of random things happen This place here. gets more crazy by the second. Yes. <laughs> it's funny. I mean, have you seen the fashion over here? Look, what are these people? What are those Yeah, the, the girls with the parasols. Konnichiwa. Hello. Do you speak English? Oh, yeah, no, not really. Oh. No, I don't speak English. Oh, that was good. <laughs> <laughs> Big smile, three, two, one. Oh, that's a great picture. <laughs> well, the Harajuku face will dress up just for the fun of it. Zoe and myself have decided that if we're going to, we want something to remember it by. Yes, and it's one of the most popular after school activities in Tokyo for girls to come down to their local video arcades, get dressed up, and then get their photos taken. Let's do it. Guess, while the girls are having the shots done, do you fancy uh, having a bit of a challenge on the arcades? Me too, so on. Yeah? Let's go, let's do it. Come on. Come on. In here. Oh! Let's right. choose our background. Oh, okay. So we do that one? Three, yeah. two, one. Flash! Oh, flash! <laughs> <laughs> that is brilliant. Oh, a beautiful what? star. Let's call it Tommy. Oh. Unfortunately, I'd had to sneak away from the arcade to a quieter part of town, as I had an appointment with one of Japan's most unusual inventors. But I was having a bit of trouble finding him. We've never seen that before. Have you ever seen that place before? <laughs> Sorry. Down the stairs, and you should come to a zebra crossing. Ah, something tells me that this is what I'm looking for. Something tells me that this is Chindogu. Chindogu means unusual, too. It's the Japanese art of designing something that's almost useful, but effectively useless. And it's the brainwave of Mr. Kenji Kawakami, who invented the craze 20 years ago. This is definitely the place. Mr. Kenji Kawakami, yeah. it's great to see you. Yes, <laughs> me too. Can you see me? Yes, oh, what sure. Are you, what, are you, what are those? Oh, this is for... Eye drops. Oh, for eye drops. Yes, very. very. It's very easy. Is that's very useful. Yes. I tell you what. This, Please try again. I'd love to try them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hey, that's very, very good. Yes. Excellent. Okay. Well, what else have we got on here? I'll oh, tell these are really chindoga. See, so this is all your chindoga. Yes. Yeah? This is a mobile tie. <laughs> a mobile phone. <laughs> that's great. Look at all that there. Great. That's good. And what else have we got? Mouth stretcher. <laughs> Why do you want to stretch your mouth? Why do you want to stretch your mouth? For health. For health. I can see. I can see why that would be beneficial to your health. <laughs> would you scratch my back? <laughs> well, I'll scratch your back, yes. Yeah. Where about? So, E4. Hang on. E4. For how's that? Is no, it... I'm sorry. F5. Oh, sorry. F5. Hang on, down a bit. There uh, we go. Yes. Is that it? Yes. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Great. Okay, thank you. Now, Mr. Kenji Kawakami, as we've been travelling around Tokyo, mm -hmm. we've had a few problems. Uh -huh. Have you got anything that could help us out? Okay, I'll show you my chindog for foreigner. Especially for Tokyo? Yeah, special. OK, great. Look at that. That looks very interesting. There's a hand in there and uh, a yes. pair of slippers Sleep with a brush on the end. And chopstick too. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll go and show these to my friends. Yeah. And uh, I'll be back soon. All right. Have a good day. I'll try. <laughs> Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 
Kenji Kawakami, yeah. I'm back. Yes. Are you all right? Great. I've been having a bit of a think yes. while I've been on my way back, and I've got some ideas. Some ideas? Uh, yeah, come and sit down and okay. let me show you. OK. Now, before I came out here, I posted a little message on our website and said, mm. can anyone come up with any sort of chin doggo ideas? Yes. And uh, this is what we had. A good one here from Tess from Gloucester. And she said, what about a pair of trousers, OK, with a chair? Yes. Built into it. Ah, uh, yes. For all those yes. lazy people. This one here has come in from yeah. Eleanor from cream. Somerset. It's yes. an ice cream ice twizzler. It uh, turns the yes, ice cream yes. for you, so you don't actually have to <laughs> turn it. You like that one, don't you? Yes, it's very funny. Eleanor is delighted with <laughs> yes. that. That's a great one. Let's make it. Yeah? Yes, let go. I'd also had some ideas of my own, including the Velcro shirt, the braces clock room, and the all-purpose belt tray. Yeah. 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 Okay. Hey. Hey. I've had a great time. Yeah. Cheers now. All right. Yeah. I'll give you a call. Yeah. yeah? All yeah. right. Great. Super. See what's on telly a little bit later on. You're all right. I tell you what. They're great. These shorts. What do you think? <laughs> After struggling with my chin doggy dessert, I went in search of our main course. But something fishy was going on. Oh, oh, going. Oh, take a seat, mate. Uh, take a seat, I've already got one, thanks. Oh, lovely, oh, lovely. Very <laughs> comfortable. And the table. Guess what on earth are you doing? Well, I'm trying to catch dinner here, Matt. This is a fishing restaurant, which basically means you have to catch a fish for eating it. So that's what I'm trying to do with my very own chin doggo. But I'm not having much luck, to be honest with you. So luckily, we've got a few things to nibble on in the meantime, and they look delicious. Yeah, yeah. this is sashimi, which is basically raw fish. We're going to be eating a lot of this on our travels. Right. And I've got just the thing to eat all this lovely food with. Would you believe that I left chopsticks out in the middle of Tokyo all day long? And no one's stolen them. There you go, Connie. There's a set for you. Lovely. There's Thanks. yours, Kev. There's yours, Matt. Do you know, Zoe, I've already got a pair. Thanks ah. very much. So, yeah, <laughs> let's get stuck in. And no waving the chopsticks about, Connie. It's very rude. Oh, okay. Mm. okay. You know what, you guys? I have had an absolutely fantastic day. <laughs> Brilliant. It really has. And uh, there's plenty more to come from our summer expedition around Japan. Yeah. Sayonara. Sayonara. Mm. In the next part of our journey, we travel south to the city of Kyoto, where Matt and I become samurai warriors. <laughs> it was.